The University of Arkansas recycled 1,893 tons of materials last year, reducing greenhouse gas emissions by 1,779 tons. Cans, bottles, and paper are collected in recycling bins in every building on campus. Our print shop recycled over 2.7 tons of printer's plates and film. Last year, we recycled 12 tons of mercury-containing light bulbs. 45 toneladas de demolición de construcción son recicladas. Surplus property reused 420 tons of furniture and equipment. We recycled 25 tons of tires, automotive batteries, solvents, antifreeze, used motor oil, and oil filters last year. 20 tons of scrap metal were recycled. Batteries and other e-waste were recycled in handy boxes all over campus. We composted over 530 tons of leaves, grass, and wood. 15 tons of waste vegetable oil from campus dining halls were converted into 3,050 gallons of biodiesel. Razorback sports fans recycled over 109 tons of cans and bottles last year. We're the University of Arkansas and we're hogs that don't create waste problems. Over the past five years, we've spent $52 million on building energy conservation and central plant energy efficiency improvements on campus. As a result, we're saving $4 million per year on energy bills and we are avoiding over 43,000 tons of greenhouse gas emissions each year. We're redesigning interior lighting by reducing the number of lamps used, upgrading ballast, and installing occupancy sensors and reflectors. We're retrofitting nearly 400 fume hoods in labs across campus, saving hundreds of thousands of dollars on energy use by vent fans and reducing the amount of conditioned air that they eject to the outdoors. We're improving control of HVAC systems by adding improved carbon monoxide monitors, sensors that control room temperatures, and state-of-the-art computer controls to heating and air conditioning systems. By 2021, we'll use only half of the fossil energy that we would have without these programs. Our energy conservation and efficiency work paves the way for solar, wind, and biomass to make us carbon neutral by 2040. 